Aldrin's um, book three, <laughs> Kellogg's Recital. Um, how many of you came to the first book and second book? Wow, you have so many friends. Thank you for your all your support. And um, is, is this the third year? Yeah, it's like one year per book. Um, he had learned cello for three years. And um, today he would like to um, present Suzuki book three for all of you. And just like our tradition, he will memorize the whole book. Uh, we have 10 songs for book three. And every song is getting, of course, longer. And uh, you're nervous or you're excited? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we will see if he qualify for book four, if he, he can make all this, make all this up, and we can go to can continue to book four. Okay, all right, thank you. Thank you. 
feel if you feel it's a singing style, please raise your hand. If you feel it's a dancing style, please raise your hand. Wow, thank you. You are all very professional. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's it sounds like a, very rhythmic, right? So um, it's a it's a dancing style. Gobot is a dancing type. Okay. All right, and then number three, minuet. Okay. Also, I will let you like figure out what kind of style it was. <laughs> Thank you. 
performers uh, want to express uh, if you can express it uh, correctly right away to, uh, to the audience and audience feel the same way that means you're you're, you're pretty good right <laughs> okay number five minuet in G so here's another minuet by uh, Ludwig von Beethoven so uh, it's a very famous composer and the minuet, uh, do you remember how many feet per bar? Okay, yeah, can, can you say it if you know it? Three. Three, thank you. So you will hear If you, if you uh, draw a, what is that, triangle, you will, you will see the, the rhythm.
because the, also for the way he played, he played legato, which means very connected melody, and also the key. It's a minor key. So if the, if it's if we play. happy, right? But now it's minor though. Yeah, so that's why it doesn't sound too much like dancing style, but actually it's a it's a dancing title with a more musical and lyric uh, um, music. Itself. Okay, number seven. It's a we. It's also a minuet. How many minuets did we play so far? <laughs> and this is the third one, right? Okay, the minuet number three by Johann Sebastian Bach. And I will have some questions for girls later, okay? <laughs>
Thank you. 
Stretch. Okay, number 10, Allegro Moderato by Johann Sebastian Bach. It's a very typical Baroque piece. Okay, uh, for Baroque, uh, they have a character for all the music. They have not only one melody. So uh, usually when you play, when you hear uh, the song, I play like a... So you can tell it's a, a compliment, it's not melody, right? But when you, when you uh, listen to Baroque music, you will hear like two, three, sometimes four or five melody lines together. They, they go on the same time. So it's pretty hard, but also very, um, very rich. And I, I, I love Baroque music because it's so rich. Okay, are you ready? Our last song, okay? <laughs>
Miss Pia Moore. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Um, so they have a surprise uh, with Elena. They want to play something for you.
for all your support and Thank you everyone for coming to my cello recital. I am very happy that many friends and family were able to come and support me, especially Mr. Cheng, Walnut Elementary School principal, was able to come. Oh. Teacher Tai Lao for teaching me for two years and eight months. Oh, two years and eight months, I don't even know. <laughs> oh, thank you. The time flies. Yeah, remember he just played book one, Twinkle, Twinkle, Little Star? Now he can play so many, many beautiful songs. So, yeah, thank you for all your support. We will keep working on uh, the cello music, also the piano music, okay? And then bring more music to all of you. Okay. Also, if any of you guys want to learn cello, you can ask them. <laughs> 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 <laughs>